Hola amigos, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to the San Temo Sunday Fair in Buenos Aires. But before that, I would like to show you the San Temo Market. San Temo Market is very interesting inside. It has restaurants, as you can see. Um, a lot of antique shops. Uh, regular souvenir stores yeah over here they're selling antiques not like those extremely expensive antiques but something interesting if you would like to decorate your home today is Sunday so it will be packed by 12 p.m. this is a toy store with a lot of toys that I have never seen before if you like to do some treasure hunt, you can be here like forever. In the middle is the restaurant area. Here it has French or sweet cuisine. It also has Greek cuisine. Wow, this ham. No. It's for decoration only, right? Wow, que rico. Oh, it also has some fresh pasta in the middle. That's a butcher shop as well as a fruit and vegetable store. I don't know if it is more expensive or not because it is a very touristy area. This market opens every single day, but restaurants um, is usually <laughs> but most of the restaurants tend to close very early. I come to my favorite cafe to have some breakfast. It is called Maxi. It has very good pastry. This is my breakfast eclair. I think that's how it's pronounced. Um, it has some sort of caramel sauce and peanuts on top. Inside also filled with the sort of caramel sauce. The drink is a marino. Basically it's hot milk and then you put some chocolate inside and let it melt. Over here, there are some antique shops. Four. Well, I love this one. Oh, they all look so pretty. They're secondhand or vintage, but the condition looks okay. Not bad. Anyone is collecting this? It looks so cute. Would you like to get a telephone? <laughs> If you like to have something with a bit of history, definitely you need to come here. Telephone. Boxes again. It's getting very crowded inside. Now let's go to the Sunday fair. This is a pizza restaurant. Look at the door front. It must have a lot of history. Can someone tell me who he is? <laughs> it has no street light on the side, but um, they managed to put something in the middle. Antique store. Let's take a look. A lot of antique bikes. Coca-Cola bottles. Cameras. Well, is it, is it a wheel car? It looks scary. That's the Spotify in the old days. <laughs> Here you can find some very nice postcards. One postcard is two fifty, five one thousand. So one postcard is less than a dollar. They also sell stamps here. Um, it's seven hundred each. Seven hundred is pretty expensive. It's almost like three dollars. You can find some old movie poster here. Wow, it looks so fancy. In this market, you are able to buy basically everything. Oh, they have shoes. It's pretty nice. Wine holder, accessories, mate cup, and the straw. Handmade wallet, paintings, and what else? A lot of people. <laughs> she is my father, a very popular political comic character in Argentina. You can find her products everywhere, every weekend. A lot of people queue up here and want to take a picture with her. 
Bobby clothes. Oh, the guy is selling bread. Very nice apron. I think it's for Barbara. Do you still use a map? Maybe this one can fit you. <laughs> this is an instrument. Orange juice lady. Hola. Muy bien. ¿Cuánto cuesta? 300. Gracias. Fresh juice is not a very common drink in Buenos Aires. The taste is relatively sour compared to those in Mexico. Nuts. Hola. Es dulce? Street fruit is not something common in Buenos Aires. Normally, you don't find people who are selling food in the street. All right, here is the, almost at the end of the fair. You can see the Buenos Aires Museum. If you sign up for a student welcome pack, you are able to get a transportation card and a SIM card for free here. It's not expensive to get a transportation card, but they are running out of stock. So it's not very easy to get one from a subtest station or from a kiosk. Public transportation in Buenos Aires is amazing. If you're able to get a transportation card, it can save you a lot of money. By the way, you can only use that card to pay for your buses and subte. You don't need to be a student in order to sign up for the student welcome pack. Mailbox, still in use. Oh, it looks so pretty. Okay, I met two very nice guys in the fair and they want to say something to you guys. What's your name? Agustin. Ariel. You're from Buenos Aires? No, Cordoba. Okay, can you recommend to our audience what we have to eat in yeah. Argentina? Here we have to eat a uh, barbecue. Asado. Barbecue, asado. Uh, asado. What yeah. kind of meat? Uh, cow. Cow. Yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> beef. Yeah. Uh, any drink that you recommend except mate? Pernet. Pernet con coca. Pernet with coca cola. Oh, see? Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's a cold drink? Yes. Okay. <laughs> alcohol. Alcohol, wow. Okay. Oh, okay. of alcohol. <laughs> drunk. Yeah. yeah. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. They just passed by and saw me filming and asked if I have a channel. <laughs> That's very interesting. Look at the amount of bread. It looks so dangerous. Besides shopping and food, you are able to find some free tango show here. But it doesn't have a schedule, maybe you can come at around 2 p.m. They usually have some tango performance here, but today is only music. Never mind, I will insert some clips that I took previously. You can try to dance or take photo with them, of course. Do you have the tip? Oh, what's going on here? Oh, the guy moved to a new location. When you love tango, you can dance anywhere. At the other end of the fair, that's one part only sells antique. That's the shoe model. A phone. How to use this one? This is so beautiful. Taxi, police car. Wow, oh, this wheel. I think it should be our last stop of the day. A lot of gloves. Wow, shoes as well. This building was built in the 1880s. Um, it's the residence of a very wealthy family. Let's take a look inside. Look at the tiles, so pretty. Interesting building. A lot of old tints. Beautiful place. Put rice in the tin. <laughs> I 
I think this video might be short, but I hope you like it. The fair is way much better if you can come to experience it by yourself. Remember to subscribe, like, comment and share. I'll see you next time. Bye!